This week is the death of Tutunui. Sounds cool, eh? No, swear it is. Tutunui was the pet whale of Tingi Lao. Now Tingi Lao was kind of a fish whisperer. Why he had a pet whale, I suppose, eh? Now Tingi Lao had set a date to marry his true love Hina, or Thena if you have a lisp. He sent a request to the high priest Guy of the Broken Teeth. Not a nice name I know, but it was true. His teeth was broken. Guy agreed to do Tingi Lao and Sina's wedding. It was the bomb. After the festivities, it was time for Guy to return to his island. He asked Tingi Lao if he could catch a ride home on Tutunui the whale because he had no sober driver. Tingi Lao agreed, but he warned Guy that if he reached the shores, Tutunui will shake, which is your signal to get off and swim to the shore. Otherwise, the whale will be torn apart on the sharp rocky shore. Guy said, sweet ass brother, and they were off. When they neared Guy's shores, Tutunui gave the signal for Guy to jump off and swim to shore. But oh my gracious, you know Guy stayed on the whale after Tingi Lao warned him. Tutunui was torn apart on the rocks. Guy and his people then cooked and ate the whale. Yum, I mean, sad. Back on the other side of the great Te Moana Nui Akiwa, that's the Pacific Ocean. Tingi Lao waited for his beloved pet to return, but no return. Galofai. After a few days, Tingi Lao became sus. He could smell the aroma of the cooked whale flesh from across the ocean, and Tingi Lao grieved for his dead pet. Then he got angry and plotted revenge. Tingi Lao turned Hamlet and hired some of his undercover entertainers to go to Guy's Island and put on a show for his village. Some of his friends included Enrique Iglesias, Michael Chitson, and Christina Aguarilla. Everyone loved it and they laughed so hard they fell asleep. This was part of Tingi Lao's plan. Tingi Lao had told them to look for the man with the worst teeth they had ever ever seen. Wait till he falls asleep, then bring him back to me. <laughs> Everything went to plan, and Guy laughed so hard the entertainers had no trouble recognizing him. When Guy woke up in Tingi Lao's fale, he realized his hangover was the least of his worries. Just goes to show kids, always brush your tiffs, otherwise the tooth fairy will not gum to you because you got a smelly breathe. Know Your Roots reserves the right to make most of this up, so if you want to know more about it, go see a dentist.